World War II was a massive campaign with en en uh, enlisted and conscription, and the troops came home in large boats, slow two-week journeys, often from France or from England. The Queen Elizabeth I, the Queen Mary were comfort ships. And it was a long, slow ride and time to reintegrate before you got home. Troops now come home solo in commercial airplanes, in their camis, dazed, sitting next to civilians who have little idea of who they are and what they're doing and where they've been. And also, these wars, unlike World War II, Though the longest wars in the history of our country have no endings, there's no victory, no V sign that you can flash, no sense that there's closure because those wars are reigniting in places like Tikrit, Mosul. We still have troops on the ground in Afghanistan and we're keeping them there for a while because the wars are very much unsettled and we will have a footprint. And that, I think, is, a, is an opportunity for re-traumatization and re-exposure to the questions, was it worth it? Was it futile? Were my sacrifices really in vain or not? 